Well, we're going to get started today by taking the headshot first, which is a 1 to 10 headshot. And the AC required view requires that you take it in landscape mode. Uh, I, I'll, as a tip, I'll often take a, a shot in portrait mode as well, just in case you use it for, for promotional services or, or for your office uh, on the wall. So let's start by taking that first. And Tiffany's here, and she's going to give me a hand and, and help us. Uh, when you're in an operatory situation, quite often uh, the shot is taken with the patient in the chair unless you have a designated room to take these shots in. So what I find re really helpful is uh, this is just a, a sunshade for a car. And what I like about it, presto, is the fact that it, there are two colored sides on it. Uh, I always select one with a black colored side and it's great for people with blonde hair or light colored hair. And there's usually a colored side. In this, in this case it's silver, but sometimes it comes in a variety of colors like green or blue. And it's nice for people with darker colored hair like, like myself. If I had black hair on black, you wouldn't see much except for my face. If the photograph is framed with the chin near the lower border, the head should be in full view for most patients. And with a 1 to 10 magnification, the patient's neck will probably be out of the frame. Patients should exhibit a full natural smile with their muscles of their face relaxed, and it shouldn't be a tensed smile. And as a guide, the patient's nose should be in the center of the photograph. You want to use the interpupillary line and vertical midline of the face to orient the camera. Don't use the lips or teeth to determine alignment, as they aren't as reliable for orientation. You want to position the patient so that no shadowing is apparent on the background. Shadows usually indicate that the subject is too close to the background. In this particular picture in, in the vertical orientation, we had the patient stand in the hallway and we just shot her, her sta standing in the hallway using the fact that you know the camera itself, uh, it, it can't possibly light up the whole hallway so it appears black so it's an easy way to get a black background. 